Did you know that the cheetah, while being the fastest land animal, isn't the fastest animal on Earth? That's right, the world of speed in the animal kingdom is a lot more complex than it seems at first glance. Let's delve into this fascinating topic, shall we? Our journey begins with the cheetah, the undisputed speed king of the land. With its lean body and powerful legs, a cheetah can clock speeds of up to 60 miles per hour in just a few seconds. This incredible acceleration allows the cheetah to capture prey before it even realizes what's happening. But if we venture into the ocean, we find an even faster creature, the black marlin. This large fish, known for its elongated body and spear-like snout can reach speeds of up to 82 miles per hour. That's right, the black marlin is faster than the cheetah. This speed comes in handy when hunting, allowing the black marlin to swiftly chase down its prey. However, the title of the fastest animal on earth goes to neither the cheetah nor the black marlin. Instead, it belongs to a bird, the peregrine falcon. When diving to catch its prey, the peregrine falcon can reach staggering speeds of over 240 miles per hour. That's faster than most sports cars. This phenomenal speed is what makes the peregrine falcon an apex predator, capable of swooping down and catching its prey mid-flight. Each of these animals, the cheetah, the black marlin, and the peregrine falcon, are perfectly adapted to their environments, using their incredible speeds to hunt and survive. Whether it's on land, in the sea, or in the air, speed is a crucial advantage in the animal kingdom. So while the cheetah may take the crown on land, it's the peregrine falcon that truly rules the skies. Next, we'll dive into the world of birds. Can you name four birds that cannot fly? If you're thinking of ostriches, emus, kiwis, and penguins, you're spot on. These unique creatures have adapted to their environments in ways that don't require flight. For instance, ostriches and emus, the largest birds on Earth, have developed powerful long legs for running, while kiwis make their homes in New Zealand's dense forests, using their strong legs and sharp beaks to forage for food. Penguins, on the other hand, are masters of the ocean, using their wing-like flippers to navigate Antarctic waters. Now, let's slow things down a bit. The title of the slowest animal on Earth goes to our friend, the sloth. It might seem like a lazy lifestyle, but their slow movement actually aids survival by making them less noticeable to predators. Though these animals might not win any races, they're perfectly suited to their unique lifestyles. Now let's switch gears and talk about the loudest animal and those with the shortest and longest lifespans. When it comes to making noise, one tiny creature takes the crown. The pistol shrimp, also known as the snapping shrimp, is the loudest creature in the ocean. Although it's only about an inch to two inches long, this shrimp can snap its claw shut so fast that it creates a bubble which, when it collapses, produces a sound louder than a jet engine. This is not just a party trick, the pistol shrimp uses this loud snap to stun or even kill its prey. It's a fascinating example of how animals can adapt to use sound as a survival tool. On the flip side, we have the mayfly, an insect with the shortest lifespan in the animal kingdom. The adult mayfly lives for only a single day. You might think that's a sad life, but it's all part of the mayfly's unique life cycle. These insects spend most of their lives underwater as nymphs, then emerge for a single day of flight, mating, and laying eggs before they die. It's a whirlwind day of life that highlights the incredible diversity of life cycles in nature. Then, at the other end of the spectrum, we have the immortal jellyfish. This tiny creature, barely the size of a pinky nail, has a remarkable ability, when faced with danger or injury, it can revert its cells back to their earliest form and begin its life anew. Essentially, it can turn back its biological clock, making it potentially immortal under the right conditions. The immortal jellyfish is a shining example of the wonders of adaptation and survival in the animal kingdom. From the shortest to the longest lifespan, the animal kingdom is truly diverse. It's a world filled with creatures that can stun with a snap, live for a day, or potentially forever. These remarkable animals show us that whether through sound, speed, or lifespan, the ways of surviving and thriving in the wild are as varied as the animals themselves. Ever wondered which animal sleeps the longest or who has the best eyesight? When it comes to champion sleepers, the koala takes the cake. This adorable marsupial from down under clocks in a whopping 22 hours of sleep every day. That's almost an entire day. You may wonder how they manage to survive while spending so little time awake. Koalas thrive on a diet of eucalyptus leaves which are low in nutrition and hard to digest. This diet necessitates long periods of rest to conserve energy. So, the next time you're called lazy for enjoying a nap, just say you're taking a leaf out of the koala's book. 
Now let's shift our gaze to the sky. The raptors, a group of birds that includes eagles and hawks are known for their exceptional vision. Their eyes are specially adapted to spot a mouse on the ground from high up in the sky. Imagine being able to read a newspaper from a high-rise building. This keen sight aids them in hunting, allowing them to spot and swoop down on their prey with deadly precision. Speaking of birds, let's not forget about the cuckoo. This bird is known for its unique approach to nesting. Instead of building its own nest, the cuckoo lays its eggs in the nests of other birds. When the baby cuckoo hatches, it pushes the other eggs or chicks out of the nest to ensure it gets all the food. This might seem lazy but it's actually a clever survival strategy that allows the cuckoo to conserve energy and ensure the survival of its offspring. Whether it's sleeping all day or having eagle eyes, each animal has its own unique superpower. These characteristics, as unusual as they may seem, help each creature thrive in their respective environments. So the next time you spot a koala sleeping, a raptor soaring, or hear a cuckoo's call, remember it's not just about survival of the fittest, but also survival of the smartest, the laziest, and even the sleepiest. You might know that tigers are ferocious predators, but did you know they're also excellent swimmers? Let's dive into this. Unlike most cats, tigers are not averse to water. In fact, they are quite adept swimmers, capable of traversing several miles in water to hunt or to escape the heat. Their powerful limbs aided by webbing between their toes make them natural swimmers. So, while they might rule the jungle, they certainly own the water too. Now, let's shift gears to something a little more venomous. When you think of dangerous creatures, the poison dart frog might not spring to mind. However, this tiny, often vibrantly colored amphibian is the most poisonous animal on Earth. A single frog carries enough poison to incapacitate even kill 10 grown men. On the other hand, the title of the most venomous creature belongs to the box jellyfish. Its venom is so potent that it can cause heart failure in humans within minutes. But wait, didn't we just call the poison dart frog the most poisonous? So, what's the difference between venomous and poisonous? Well, it's all about delivery. Poisonous creatures, like our dart frog, have toxins that are harmful if you touch, ingest, or inhale them. Venomous creatures, like the box jellyfish, deliver their toxins directly into other organisms through a bite or a sting. So, while both poison and venom are toxins, the difference lies in how they're delivered. A fun way to remember this is, if you bite it and you die, it's poisonous. If it bites you and you die, it's venomous. So next time you think about tigers, don't forget they're as much at home in the water as they are on land. And remember, whether it's a tiny frog or a graceful jellyfish, sometimes the most dangerous creatures come in the most unassuming packages. Let's talk about the tallest, strongest, and most creative animals in the world. When we think of the tallest animals, the image of a majestic giraffe stretching its long neck to reach the topmost leaves of an acacia tree likely comes to mind. Indeed, the giraffe is the tallest land animal with its height reaching up to 18 feet for males and slightly less for females. This height advantage allows giraffes to eat from the higher branches, which are often left untouched by other herbivores. Now let's shift gears to the world of insects. You might be surprised to learn that the title of the strongest animal does not belong to a massive elephant or a muscular gorilla, but to a tiny creature known as the dung beetle. Despite its modest size, a dung beetle can lift a weight that is 1,000 times its own body weight. That's like a human lifting six double-decker buses. This incredible strength helps dung beetles roll balls of dung much larger than themselves, which they use for food and as a place to lay their eggs. Finally, let's explore the realm of creativity in the animal kingdom. Here, the chimpanzee takes center stage. These primates are known for their remarkable problem-solving skills and ability to use tools. They can fashion sticks into tools to extract termites from their mounds, use stones to crack open nuts, and even create sponges from leaves to soak up drinking water from hard-to-reach places. This creativity allows chimpanzees to access food sources that other animals can't, giving them a significant advantage in the wild. Although size and strength often go hand in hand, it's the tiny dung beetle that takes the title of strongest animal. So, remember, in the world of animals, it's not always the biggest that's the strongest, and it's often the ones with the most creativity that have the upper hand. It's time to uncover the deadliest and the fastest among the animals. When we think of deadly animals, our minds might jump to apex predators like sharks or venomous snakes. However, the deadliest animal on Earth is a creature much smaller and quite frankly, much more unassuming than these fearsome beasts. It's the Anopheles mosquito. Yes, that's correct. This tiny insect is responsible for the deaths of more human beings each year than any other animal. 
due to its transmission of malaria. It's a stark reminder that size doesn't always equate to threat level. Now let's switch gears to the fastest. While the cheetah holds the title for the fastest land animal, the greyhound dog is not far behind. With their slender build and powerful legs, greyhounds can reach impressive speeds, making them the fastest canine on the planet. But what about the largest of the slithering kind? The python holds the record for the longest snake, dwarfing many other snake species with its impressive length. However, when it comes to sheer bulk and weight, the green anaconda takes the crown. These colossal serpents are known for their size and strength, making them one of the most formidable predators in their ecosystem. We've talked about animals on land and in water, but what about the sky? Most might think birds are the only mammals that have the gift of flight. However, there's a group of mammals that have taken to the skies as well, the bats. Yes, bats are mammals, and they are the only mammals capable of sustained flight, adding another fascinating facet to the animal kingdom. While the mosquito may seem harmless, it is, in fact, the deadliest animal on Earth. So next time you're captivated by the speed of a greyhound or the size of an anaconda, remember the tiny mosquito and its lethal potential. It's a testament to the incredible diversity and complexity of our natural world. Let's recap some of the fascinating animal facts we've learned today. We've journeyed through the animal kingdom, uncovering secrets and busting myths. The cheetah, while fast on land, is no match for the black marlin in the sea, or the peregrine falcon in the air. The world's slowest animal, the sloth, may not win races, but it's a champion in the sleep department, rivaled only by the koala. We've learned that not all birds are built for flight, with the ostrich, emu, kiwi and penguin preferring to keep their feet on the ground. The largest animal on earth is the blue whale, a mammal, not a fish, just like the dolphin. And who knew that the rhino's horn is made of hair and that sharks never sleep? The animal kingdom is full of exceptional senses, from the raptor's keen eyesight to the bear's incredible sense of smell. We've seen that the laziest bird, the cuckoo, outsources nest building to others, while the most poisonous and venomous creatures, the poison dart frog and box jellyfish, command respect with their deadly toxins. Remember the tallest animal, the giraffe, and the strongest, the dung beetle, which can lift a weight a thousand times its own body weight? We discovered that the flea jumps the highest and the saltwater crocodile has the most powerful bite. The largest bird, the ostrich, stands taller than most humans, and the smallest bird, the bee hummingbird, would barely be a blip on the radar. We've also learned about the smartest animal, the raven, and the most creative, the chimpanzee. But the deadliest animal is the unassuming Anopheles mosquito. We've covered the fastest dog, the greyhound, and the smallest, the chihuahua. The longest snake is the python and the largest is the green anaconda. Did all these facts surprise you? If you enjoyed learning about these amazing creatures, don't forget to hit the like button. Have an answer for the flying mammal question? Drop a comment below. And if you're still curious, make sure to subscribe to our channel for more fascinating facts. Remember, the animal kingdom is full of surprises and there's always more to learn. Until next time, keep exploring.